So here we have this old parking lot behind the Shaw's. Um, and it's got some interesting botany going on here. So we're going to take a look at what's around. And uh, right here I can tell you it's a black locust tree. Um, black locust has these sort of pinnate leaves, rounded edges, kind of like all legumes. It's got some mugwort, um, a catalpa, which is such a legendary, awesome tree. With these big leaves and big bean-like pods. Let's check out what's over here. This is pretty cool to see. You've got this really um, sun-heavy environment. So uh, this goldenrod is already popping up over here. This one's like in full bloom already. It's July. This is some sort of a uh, tick clover or whatever. Uh, maybe I'll pop up the IDs later. Lots of this uh, purple loose strife. Um, oh, wow. oh, we got some sort of like... Oh, another bean. Look at this. That bean-like flower. And then the pinnate leaves that so many beans share. Oh, that's cool. Bone sets and some uh, ferns out there. Some poison ivy. Already changing color. Pretty interesting to see it changing so quickly, but this environment's pretty intense, so I'm not totally surprised. I think all these trees up through here are eastern cottonwood. I saw some cottonwood in bloom nearby, or it had its little feathery seeds, so uh, I wouldn't be surprised. What do we got going on over here? Berry action on this plant. This is a pretty weird one. It appears to be a bulrush. Um, it's got its flowers basically coming right out of the base there. This is more of it. More, more bone set over here. Checking out this spotted knapweed. A couple of these, look at that one. God, I gotta get a new phone. So yeah, I suppose that's been the, the botany of this uh, this field. 